Alright, so listen, Clover Alliance. In this video today, I'll just be showing y'all and talking about Ishiki Ukutsuki, the DLC that's going to be coming to Naruto the Boy through Shinobu Shiker in November or December. I'll be showing y'all what his abilities may be and what is his Jutsu his substitution and ultimates may be as well. So make sure y'all subscribe and let's get it. To where it's first in Jutsu, I honestly think it'll be something that have to do with the rise that he used against Naruto and all his other opponents. As we saw for Jigen, he used rise as well too to like lock down Naruto's chakra and seal him away when he was fighting with Sasuke. And I honestly feel like this is a really good ability because one, if Ishiki is 100% on range, because we all know that he is going to be on range, and he's definitely not going to be on ATK if he is going to be on that. But if he is on range, man, I definitely think that Ishiki is going to have the first or second in Jutsu as the rod moves he does use. And also, this move kind of seal off their chakra nature and kind of lower their decrease in speed and everything. And I think that would just be perfect for range since they already have a lot of stuff like Lightning Shuriken that already does that. For second in Jutsu, I definitely think it'll be his box ability. Now, I do not know what this is called. I'm not going to lie to you. I did not look up the research for that ability that much, but I do know that that ability is pretty OP. It is kind of like a visual effect because he can kind of shrink the box and then like open it up again and like shrink the box and like make them bigger and make them small. And as we all saw in the anime, how he sealed up Naruto with that box itself. He literally sealed him up and that's when Sasuke had to use time space hop to get away, man. For a substitution, I honestly think that we will probably shrink into the ground and then like decrease but that didn't even make sense. What I basically mean by a substitution, shrinking and everything into the ground. When you substitute, you should be able to get smaller. Maybe like in health or like gain extra abilities. Or maybe your Ninjutsu cooldown time will be lower once you shrink into the ground. And that will honestly make a lot of sense since he did shrink and go up to Sasuke's shoulder and Baruto. His eye ability is really OP. I really think that will be a good substitution to us. For the ultimate, not gonna lie, I really do not know what we could have as the ultimate because he, he really just used the rods and he really used the box, it's not gonna lie to you. But it's nothing that he was using. The reason why he wanted to kill Kawaki or Boruto so bad is because he got unlock his final form. Now, I'm not saying his final form may be ultimate, but hey, but we never know. Let me know what y'all think about the comment section. Let me know what y'all think his Jutsu's will be. And that'll be it for the video, man. Make sure y'all boys drop a like on the video if haven't already. And also, subscribe to the channel, man. Your boy been gone, but we're trying to hit this 2K this year, bro. And it's all up to y'all, you feel me? So, I hope y'all enjoyed and have a blessed day.